switch to the speakers on the setup. I also had to output the HDMI to the capture card and to the, uh, the USB audio codec for all the commentary setup. Um, the issue is you can't do that because it'll only take one or the other, so it, pri it prioritizes the headphones. So then everything else just gets muted. Could you not do like a headphone splitter or something? What I did is that I changed out the monitors and used a monitor that had like an a like a direct headphone or a direct headphone jack to it, so I could plug the speakers directly into the monitor. Okay. And so then the switch could take the audio and put it to like the capture card and everything else. Right. And now it's working fine. Right, right, that fixes it. It was just like, why is that a thing? I don't know. Well, we're here in game one now. Yes, we are. Let me change that. Train taking a noticeable lead, but we'll see how Noel all you know, capitalizes on this. I'm always surprised by how long people like get stuck in Yoshi eggs in this game. Oh yeah, yeah. I, I think it's longer. I it's a little bit longer than I expected whenever I played trans. Um, especially like late percents, it's really hard to match out of it. But then part of me also feels like people are just bad at matching, and I don't know which <laughs> one's true. Yeah, that's 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 the case definitely with me. Um, yeah, I, I also think like composure is definitely an important factor there because like notice that um, Narwhal held onto his jump even after getting put in the egg. So you can recover safely. Yeah. Standard up smash right there. You know, something I'm not noticing. Does that confirm? Does like the first hit of that up down be confirmed to like the second hit on ground? Like I that? I think so. Or I'm could not you, certain. Like, potentially like SDI out of it or something. Oh no no no! You definitely couldn't SDI out of it. Uh, in this game, SDI is like it is a thing, but it's a lot weaker than uh, than melee. Um, a lot of those those multi hit moves. Also, you just okay. You got that. Yeah, a lot, a lot of multi hit moves like that, of like one two hits. Like that, like he can't SDI out of that easily. Might be able to get out a little bit sooner. A lot of back air. Oh yeah, yeah. Inkling's back air is really good in this game. I would assume so. I feel like back air is just like a universally good move in every Smash game. Like if your yeah. character doesn't have a good back air, like you probably shouldn't be playing that character, honestly. Well, I, I I don't feel like that's as important in Ultimate as it is having good neutral air, because like. I feel like I feel like every like almost every character in Ultimate from my like my awful at the game perspective seems to have like just a really safe aerial and shield that they just kind of spam in neutral. Mm -hmm. Yeah, which I mean, something that surprised me is how how much jumping Narwhal is doing because uh, Inkling's one of the few characters that has a sort of melee esque neutral game. Um, she can dash dance and make her movement really. Uh, uh, What's the word? Ambiguous. Ambiguous, that's it, thank you. And, um, that's another thing, like, if he messes up on that jab, it's a big commitment, because the jab has so much end lag that Yoshi just gets free punish. They're both playing so safe. Yeah, it's last bit. And Yoshi with rage is gonna kill you at that percent. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He's gonna, he's gonna kill you, yeah, that <laughs> Just called him out and just did it. <laughs> it's still, it still like boggles my mind watching Yoshi jump out of shield. So I'm oh, not used to Yoshi being able to do that. So it's oh like yeah, I see yeah. that and I'm like, that's so. <laughs> it's cursed. Strange. <laughs> like, does Yoshi's shield? Well, I guess shields in this game probably work a lot better than they do in previous yeah. patch games, where they don't get shield pokes as often. Yeah, I don't feel like shield, shield pokes are a thing almost at all, really. Yeah. Um, which I think is why uh, you, you, you see shield breaks a lot more in ultimate than in melee. Yeah. Um, well, because I know that was the case in, like, Brawl and to a lesser extent Smash 4 as well, but, like, 
It yeah. seems like whenever I, w I play this game, I never I play or like watch this game, I never see anyone get shield poked. Yeah, yeah, and and also, um, you know, even playing people with bad shields, you you don't have to use like shield tilt. I I I heard Labor think about that. Well, see, I don't know how shield t shield tilting works in this game. I just always get tilted when I play this game because I try to do the thing. Like you land on like a platform and then tilt your shield in one direction during like the, the landing lag of like you landing on a platform. But because of the input buffer and in ultimate, you'll just buffer or roll doing yeah, that. Yeah, yeah. And I, I always get super upset. <laughs> well, I yeah, I, I think it's about like knowing how the shield how the input buffer works, because um, it can work to your favor. Yeah, he's he's dead there. Yeah, because like if you know how to utilize it correctly, some characters it's so easy to just be frame perfect with, and I, I feel like that's. One of Ultimate's big strengths is that you don't have to worry about being frame perfect so much as you do just like making better choices than your opponent. Like right there, Narwhal just tried to just come down. See, I like that. I like that edge guard. That's like the first person I've seen. I think be like a good job of just like going low, to make sure that Inkling can't. Recover, just go to low and free recover. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, because if also you. Also, that up air killed off the top. <laughs> yeah. I mean, that down air killed off the top. Not up air. Yeah, if you want to actually gimp Inkling, uh, you can't just try and two frame her. Uh, you you got to go off the stage and. Well, cause that's, that's what I know. So I was thinking, like, you could, like, theoretically, I guess, two frame Inkling recovery. But yeah. It would be a hard read on the timing since the recovery is so fast. You, you like, can't react to it very well. Well, well it's it's not just that. It's that, um, it's the amount of magnet hands. Uh, I believe Inkling has one of the, like, longest ranges of, like, how far she snaps to ledge. Yeah. Um, so with her, it's just about impossible to frame her. Up there. A classic. Yeah, yeah. Trans just reacting to Narwhal's attacks on shield. I feel like there, after he gets the double jump armor away from Yoshi, he should go off stage to like make sure that if he air dodges towards the stage to recover, he'll just hit him. So I feel like Yoshi has no option but to just air dodge towards the stage in that situation. Um, but I don't know if he he'll could, grab he egg. His his up B actually pushes him up a little bit in this game. But I don't know if he has like. So if you air dodge towards the stage, is there a brief moment, like before you grab ledge, in most cases, in which you're like vulnerable? Yes. Or will you infinitely like snap? The yeah, ledge? yeah. Um, there, there, there's. If you can space it really well, there's only a couple. What is? Okay. <laughs> I did not know what he was going for there. Um, he's gonna need a miracle to make this comeback. But but I'd say yes. Yeah, there's there's always at least a couple frames. I mean, if he wants to make this comeback, this is how this is how he has to do it. Just space him out and just stuff Inkling's approaches. Well, Yoshi eggs do a good amount of damage, so like, yeah. Also, he's so good at using those to get back to stage. He's beer versing to make his. His aerial drift really ambiguous. Yes. I feel like a well placed smash attack will just kill at this point. Oh yeah, yeah. It, oh, but that, well, that was yeah. awesome. <laughs> I mean Yoshi's over like two hundred percent. I most anything would kill at that point. <laughs> Alright, so that's that's two oh then? Yes. Okay, okay. But but now uh, Trans is making these games close, so he could bring it back. Let's have to see how much he adjusts between. I wonder how much he knows this matchup. Oh, I'm sure that they that both of them know this matchup. Well, as well I, as I feel like I see both these characters pretty often. Like they're not neither of his characters are particularly uncommon. Yeah, it's just that like. There are so many characters in this game that I feel like knowing every matchup is virtually impossible. Yeah, yeah, it's it's probably not like Melee where they've lapped out. What are you doing? I wonder what the Lila choice is for. Um, I feel like might... people only go Lila if they, if 
they think they can't win like on an actual stage. <laughs> well, yeah, it might be to interact with uh, Inkling's up B again, because Inkling yeah. can't just like ride up the side of the stage. That's true. Um, but yeah, I'm, maybe it's because of the really low platforms and Yoshi can't interact with them somehow. I, I don't play either of these characters, so I don't know. Wait, what am I saying? I, I, I pocket Inkling. I don't play Inkling the way Narwhal does. <laughs> The only two characters I know anything about in this game are Incineroar and Pikachu, so if it's not <laughs> those characters, I, I'm, I'm, I'm useless. So when you're playing Pikachu, how, 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 how much game knowledge do you feel like transfers from Melee to Ultimate? Um, so, I remember quite a, a decent amount. More than, <laughs> that killed them. Wow. More than you would expect. I think the issue is just that the same kind of principle for playing the character applies. A lot of the same stuff is what you want to do. The issue is that, like, the moves you use to do combos and things like that and play neutral round are, like, the opposite of what mm -hmm. you do in melee. Like, in Ultimate, like, stuff like Pikachu's Fair is, like, crazy good, right? Yeah, yeah, in, yeah. In, in, in melee, Pikachu's Fair is awful. Also, you hate to see that. I, uh, uh, <laughs> you really hate to see that. For, for a minute there, I thought Narwhal was going off stage to save him. No. Um, yeah, yeah, because, like, I've, I've played Marth in this game. It's such a different game plan of, like, no, you don't side B to recover. You 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 use side B on stage. Yeah. Which is... Uh, it's like an attack, yeah. An completely move. opposite. I can't really like that down there. I don't... It obviously is really good because it's been working a lot. It's just, it always, like, catches me off guard, right? Because I, I watched down air, and there's that one time I just killed off the top, and I'm just like, why? I don't know why I cooked that for so long. Like that guy killed off the top, like that killed off the top. <laughs> it's so weird. It's so strange. But yeah, what you're saying about these matchups, I feel like if anything, um, I, I feel like Yoshi's the more uncommon character out of these two. So if anything, Trans might be able to Tran, Tran might be able to pull something out of here. I, know, I, I guess I've just seen Yoshi more because I know Justin Carter used to play Yoshi whenever I play. We played Ultimate. Oh, does he? Yeah. So I know how the character works. Well, it's looking like Trans is going to be able to take this game. Oh. Okay. I thought he was going to give him again doing that. No, he can. He can. Wow. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. It's it's so different. Oh, I never changed that. That's my bad. Oh, I'm bad. Um, I'm an so awful it's now it's now 2-1 Narwhal's favor. I'm an awful stream runner. What would you say? Oh, I just realized I never switched the view over to from oh. players plus gameplay delay to just gameplay. So, <laughs> do, do you want me sitting over there? No, I it's fine. I got it. I just need to like remember to change it between games. This feels weird. Like you're you're a good four feet away from me, and I'm just talking in normal. Yeah. The uh, the magic of commentary. Yeah. Also, I hate it whenever Micah plays on screen because his name barely fits in the little name tag on a screen layout, and it makes me upset. <laughs> Oh, Narwhal Slayer? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I don't, I don't like the kerning of that. Oh, oh! He got him! He got the Sage Spike. Gosh. I feel like if there's anybody you could gimp like that, it Yoshi would be it. Is he? No, he's not good. Okay. No, no, no. Every time that, that sends upwards after the knock, the knockback sends upwards on movement. It's weird. It, it, why does it do that? <laughs> yeah, yeah. And in, in melee, it sends them down, right? Well, it's like Yoshi already has like up air, which is already like a really good like <laughs> vertical kill move. He's he's been so good at like calling out the the, the neutral bees. Uh, Tran has just like he he knows when to do it, and like I don't feel like I've seen him miss. Isn't Yoshi's Nair in this game like 
transcendent priority. Um, it's it's like Luigi's Nair in Melee. Yeah, it just comes out so fast, and it's just like here it is. Yeah, yeah, my it's leg. like yeah, yeah. Um, oh, you've you've touched my shield. Um, prepare oh, to take damage. Okay, I thought. I always expect like special moves in the air to send people into free fall, but they never do. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So I saw him miss like that side B on the lay stage, and I was like, oh, he's gonna die, but then. Just one one that always caught me off guard was um Fox, cause like you can yeah, use his side B. B and, um, yeah. I, I know that, cause I used to be a Fox main in Smash Four. So. Like, oh yeah, you played Smash Four. Yeah, I forgot about that. I was a I was a pretty good Smash Four player back in my day, before I was became a traitor. <laughs> Up air juggles. God, Tran is so good at those combos, just keeping him in disadvantage state like that. Look at that. I want to hear my boomer, my big boomer brain take on 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 something. All right. I right hate here. the term disadvantage state and advantage state. Well, I'm I'm sorry. Is there a better word you have for it? I just call it being comboed. Okay. Okay. Getting comboed and comboing. Yeah. <laughs> Like, or like edge guarding versus being edge guarded. I, I don't like the term like advantage state and disadvantage state sounds too much like I don't know. Oh, it just ran up to it. <laughs> well, I mean, I I don't I don't consider that the same thing. Like edge guarding isn't the same as an advantage state. Well, I mean, if you are edge guarding someone, you could consider that a state of advantage, could you not? Sure, sure, sure. But like, I don't, I don't, I don't feel like I've heard people call it that. Specifically applying to edge guards, but that's what I think about, right? It's like, I don't know. Listen, I'm, I'm not saying you're wrong. I'm not saying you're wrong. I'm just, I'm just a big Smash boomer, and <laughs> I, I hate change. And these words are new to me, and so I don't like it. It's game five right here. Just like I suggested, he's just, he's brought it back. I also just noticed they're both playing the pink color of their characters. Well, they've been going like around the world as far as their skins go. That's true. I mean, Yoshi's just like color swap of all his different skins, right? It's yeah. Like, here's blue, here's red. And I feel like that's never changed through any Smash game. Well, now in this one, he's also got the one where he's just covered in moss. That's true. Oh, yeah, the, the, the <laughs> yarn Yoshi. Oh, it's so ugly. It's so bad. Did you just hear that chirp? Yeah, it was the mic was peeking there for a oh. second. Yeah, I know. <laughs> yeah, wool Yoshi is so. Yarn Yoshi or whatever it is. Yeah, Yarn Yoshi is so ugly. No, it's it's not Yarn Yoshi. I found this out uh, uh, a short time ago. It's not Yarn Yoshi. It's a it's from Wooly, like Yoshi's crafted Wooly world. world. Yeah, crafted world thing. Yeah, okay. it's, it's wool. It's just like if you look at like the, the the textures on the model on like the victory animation screen, it's so bad. <laughs> it just looks disgusting to me. It's, just, it's so gross. It just looks like he's like made of grass. <laughs> Well, I mean, that's that's what I said. I, th I think he's made of moss. Yeah, it's just... Uh, yeah. It's like Green I Pikachu. Green Pikachu just has the suds. He's got the suds. Uh. <laughs> his, his texture doesn't look god-awful. Uh, they probably need some ultimate people commentating for ultimate. <laughs> May maybe. Speaking of awful models in ultimate... I think Wolf's model in this game looks atrocious. Wolf's? Yeah, I think it looks so bad. I haven't like looked at it in a while, but I remember like when the game I'm first not... came out, I looked at it and I was like, that looks so bad. Yeah, I've, I've not thought about it. But I mean, nothing compares to green Yoshi. <laughs> oh my god. Infected Yoshi. God. They're keeping this game really close. That's a rage episode. He he's... with two eggs there. Yeah, he's so good at using those eggs. I like how whenever Yoshi gets Yoshi's shield gets hit by the ink, like part of his shield like gets painted too. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I think that's a really cool touch. <laughs> Fun little if, attention. If Yoshi detail. himself is painted and then he goes in shield, does the shield does the paint particles I have no idea. That'd be really cool if it didn't though. Yeah, yeah, it would be. I feel like it does probably. I like how he's using his neutral beat to um to to like change his um, his momentum. Yeah. It's like float canceling a melee. Can Yoshi not do that in this game? Does his double jump not give him like the no, no. cancel? No, nobody does. That's interesting. Not Ness, not, Mew not Mewtwo, nobody. I really like that mechanic. I wonder why they removed it. Oh yeah, it's so sick. 
I, I feel like it makes Mewtwo a lot worse in particular. Because I've tried him, like, he, he just can't do any of his, his, what few cool things he can do in melee. Um, he's got a really good forward air now. Alright, last duck. I feel like Narwhal could bring this back. Um, 90% is not a lead, except that it is. <laughs> well, I just, I, I feel like knowing Inklings. Wow. Yeah, Inkling has the ability to rack up damage. Really yeah, yeah, just just seeing if he gets really good tech chase going, he That's could, but this kill. is probably it. Yep. Game five, going to Tran. Man, what, what a set. That was a good set. It was. It really was.